Let's talk about ways you can get B12 naturally really quickly because B12 deficiency can and does happen. So Leslie, in all of your research, I'm curious if, if before you went into it, you knew all the natural sources of B12. Of course I did, Travis. <laughs> you're smart. She's been doing the show for many years now, she yeah. knows. But Brooke, I'm curious, do you supplement in terms of are you real kind of eating foods that are fortified as a vegan so that you make sure you're getting your B12? Absolutely, I'm constantly reading every blog, every magazine article, every TV show you guys especially oh, listen to, you. what you recommend. One important point, if you go to a reputable place and they do it the right way and it's truly B12 and you get an injection, the good news is given that it's water soluble, you will and should just urinate it out if you have excess levels. The biggest issue that I have with this entire story and investigation is that if you've worked all week and, and your B12 levels are fine and someone convinces you, a con artist, that you should be paying 50 bucks every week for injections that you don't need, to me, you're just flushing money down the toilet when you don't need to. If you're low, you need it. If you're not low, you're flushing money down the toilet. And, and it can interact with other medications you're taking. So do remember, it is a supplement. It might interact with your other products. There are a lot of reports in dermatology that over, higher doses of B12 can cause an acne-like rash and make your acne worse. Mm -hmm. So it's not totally benign, but usually will just be Can we talk about yeah. for a minute? Well, that's it. If you are getting a therapeutic effect, yeah. and it, okay, it's placebo effect, but it still is an so effect. So let's ask so, the two of you that, that you have perfectly fine levels of B12. Looking back now, what were your expectations going into this? I thought that I was gonna get a boost of energy and I believed I did. Um, placebo allowed me to keep up after my daughter, which was, I mean, for me, a great thing. I know I went into it having these huge expectations, like, oh wow, I was gonna get this boost of energy, I was gonna go run a marathon, I was gonna be able to get up at 6 a.m. and go hike 10 miles, but it wasn't a traumatic, life-changing event. All right, Leslie, before we go, any last words of wisdom? I just really think that everybody should not, you know, take what people are telling you with a grain of salt. Really do your own research. Is this place reputable? Are they just part of this wellness craze? They're just trying to sell you, sell you, sell you. I would really watch out for the places that are trying add, to sell it as a weight loss. If you think you're low on B12, yeah. get your levels tested. I'm actually really proud you did that with these Thank three ladies. You. you all were great. Thank, Thank you so you. much for participating. <laughs>